Good morning, everybody. Pastor Stitch, Narrow Path Christian Church, B.C., Bay City, Michigan. Welcome to the Biker Devotional. Today is October 1st, and I was reading in Proverbs chapter 1 today. And as I was reading and thinking about what is it that God wants me to share, sometimes it's really, really important that we read in first person what the Word has to say and hear the correction. You know, Proverbs was written that by King Solomon so that in, he says in verse 2, for the learning that wisdom and discipline are for understanding it are and for understanding insightful sayings, for receiving wise instruction in righteousness, justice, and integrity, for teaching shrewdness to the inexperienced, knowledge and discretion to the young man. That's what he wrote it for. He wanted us to learn some things. And so often we like to hold on to all the great things that we get to learn from it. But more often than not, the best teaching comes from what's going to happen if we we were stupid. Solomon goes on in starting in verse 20 and talks about the fact that wisdom calls out to us. With great insight, wants us to hear. But we don't often listen, do we? We reject what is said. And I want you to hear what happens if we do that. Reading it as if it's speaking directly to you or directly to me. Starting in verse 24. Since I called out and you refused, extended my hand, and you paid no attention, since you neglected all my counsel, it did not accept my correction. I, in turn, will laugh at your calamity. I will mock when terror strikes you. When terror strikes you like a storm and your calamity comes like a whirlwind, when trouble and stress overcome you, then you will call for me, but I won't answer. You will search for me, but won't find me. Because you hated knowledge, didn't choose to fear the Lord, were not interested in my counsel, and rejected all my correction, you will eat the fruit of your way and be glutted with your own schemes. For the turning away of the inexperienced will kill you, and the complacency of fools will destroy you. But whoever listens to me will live securely and be free from the fear of danger. So often we reject so much and we think that, well, it'll be okay. Um, the answer is no, it won't be okay. So many places throughout scripture speak to you and I exactly this way. We need to put our focus on Jesus. And we need to keep it there. We need to allow him to correct us, whether it's through the written word of the Bible or through someone who is speaking to us in some way. It's important that we receive the correction of wisdom. And we recognize that the beginning of all knowledge and wisdom is putting our focus on God. Verse 7, the fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge. Fools despise wisdom and discipline. Let's go out into the day and remember, we have to listen too. I love you all. Hope you have a great day. God bless.